Hi there, Chris here. This is just a quick um, video kind of answering some questions Pocket Woman had about the Abus 83 series. Um, she had a core that Loctis Modus sent her with a padlock, 83 Abus uh, padlock, to put all together. And her core, this is what I usually see. This is uh, for the Abus ones for the 83 series. This one happens to have a Schlage keyway. 300 means it's a Schlage, even though it has an Avis stamp on the, the key. And so you pick it, you take the clip off on these, and then when the core is rotated, you depress this to be able, this little pin, which depresses to be able to slide the core out. Now hers, and I looked through all my uh, cylinders, I have probably 10 of these bodies and probably 15 to 18 different cores that will go into them. Um, this one happens to be a Lockwood. This, if you can get a hold of one of these guys, it this will put just about any kick cylinder in this 83 series. Um, and with this this back on it, it works. This one happens to have a Schlage Primus core in it that also has that, when you see this round dome, that's that little conversion thing. But what, what I wanted to address with Pocket Woman, hers did not have the little depressing thing um, that little depressed pin, which just depresses, it doesn't come out, it just depresses. But she had a little uh, black sleeve, plastic sleeve that went in there. Now I've seen those before, I thought I had one, I don't. But when she didn't use it, it wasn't going in, or she had to fight it or something. And her lock, she did get it together and everything in there and working, but her lock was like stiff. So what um, what I think with that plastic core is it sets in here and there's a, it's a li there's a little width right there. And what that does is align this core so that it is aligned with the Bible um, because it spaces it out just a little bit. And then, then it'll be a smooth turning core. And if I'm remembering correctly, I think it has to go in from the front and the thick end, that little space part goes here. Um, anyway, so I think that's why it, your core uh, pocket woman was turning a little bit tight because it was just, this um, core to the Bible was just misaligned just that little space that the uh, black sleeve puts in there. Um, check out your sleeve and I think you'll see on the front part, it's, I can't give you a measurement, but it is, it does create the, the correct spacing. So speaking of spacing, there we go. It's just a rough key. So, but that is why I love these 80, Abus AB83 series 45s because you can make them key retaining when you have this um, type of converter guy. This one I've modified because it's it's a little loose on there, so I just put a little piece of um, windshield wiper in there just to make it so that when everything goes together it's tight because you can see there's a little bit of room in here so you could put a lockwood in there you could put a multi-lock with <laughs> all the bells and whistles in there you could put in a vetus core is that a, yes a vetus core that'll drive you crazy you put in quick set, you could put in Schleg, you can put in either the Primus or you could put in, I have um, Everest that you could put in there. Anyway, so that was just a quick 
hopefully an answer on why your lock was, was binding a little bit. And great series, Pocket Woman. Great work getting it back together. And also great work on your lotto lock exploding and cleaning and finding out why it was virtually unpickable because you had springs that were supposed to be this big and they were about that big. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, we will see you next time.